Yes, sir, Jim. Oh, you poop head. Yes, sir. March 2nd, 2019, the first episode of Basswood Plus Hunter Fish for this season, of course, my man Jim Wheeler. We're on Braidwood Lake in Illinois, a warm water discharge lake, and we caught some fish. Now, let me tell you though, if you watched me fish with Jim for a while, I had a personal goal, Jim. My goal today was to kick your butt. Because <laughs> every time I fish with him, he kicks my butt. But uh, guess, and guess what? It didn't happen. We caught a few though. We did. We both we caught, caught a few. them. The, the, I think the most impressive thing is number one, he didn't kick my butt. But number two, I caught the first fish. Yeah. Uh oh, Jimmy. There we go. Ah. Here we go. First fish of the day. You think he liked that chatter bug? We got that thing deep. And the biggest. And the biggest fish, the biggest. that's right. Uh huh. First yeah. biggest. Hold on, catching fish right now. That's how you do it on the phone. That's a good one, Jim. Bad. I'd help you, but my hands are cold. <laughs> You're all hard, man. Come here. So, what do you say? One on chatterbait, and then the better one on the monkey punch. Yes, sir. Look how fat that belly is. Our patterns are what we figured out today. I'm gonna say caught him on 9K Elite Lewis Chatterbug. I mean, I I'll say it, almost all of our fish came on that except yep. for a few on the Loch Ness Lures uh, Monkey Punch. Yeah, plug in the sponsors, but you can see right there that they catch fish. Got him. Nice, Jimmy. Yes, sir. Got him? The old chatterbug. So, Jim, I'm curious to pick your brain and what you thought. This is our first time here. It, I think it's a neat lake. I mean, anytime you come out the second of March and fish in 60 degree water you need to go it, it, I've never been here before either and this is neat I mean you got steam everywhere on the lake um, but the fish are shallow I mean they're right on the banks and it, it was a good time I've never done anything like this yeah, it's same, same for me and you notice the uh, forecast day was all overcast with 10 to 15 mile per hour winds uh, it was below freezing almost all Long. There were a couple moments. It was cold. Yeah. Don't let them lie. It's been cold out here. There were, there were a handful of moments where the ice was not forming on your rod yeah. guides. I mean, a couple of moments, but it didn't last very long. But yeah, I mean, it's below freezing, and yet we're fishing in water temperatures anywhere between uh, 58 and 66 degrees. Got her? Yeah. Of course, I can catch small one here, but starting to have fun on March 2nd. Suck on that chatterbug. That's a good one. Let me just take it with mine. Cute though. Junkie monkey. There's no doubt we're figuring out these fish are relating to points out here. Over there, we'll give it. Fish y'all? Yeah. 
Yes, sir. We found, really, I would say the biggest pattern we found is anytime some deep water cut up close next to the reeds, it, we caught fish. It got to the point for a while where it seemed like we were calling our shot uh, with those yeah. monkey punches or uh, chatterbugs. Another chatterbug fish. Yep. <laughs> Hey, there we go. Get over here. Ah. About halfway back to the boat. That's so. That's the deal here. We caught some of that Loch Ness lures, monkey punch, but that chatter bug has been a deal. A couple different colors. Oh, if it ain't the chatterbug, it's the monkey punch. That's what it is. Go up here against the shoreline. Uh, it, it cuts it. We're out here in 15 foot of water and casting into literally two feet of water, which goes up almost right next to the reeds, where the break line is. Definitely found a pattern. Deep water next to those reeds. I've been holding fish out here. So right now, hit that subscribe button. Click the notification so you know every time we release a video, 2019 season is upon us. Thanks for watching. Until the next time, we will see you on the water. There you go.